One, two, three, go play. Look at it. Yes. MOG thumbs up. Well, I know you. You're the hot shot who silenced that shaper thing, yeah? Word travels fast. I keep an ear to the ground. Best way to stay alive out here. Maxine. Call me Max. Welcome to... my bar. You're the owner? Am now. Got it off Dusty in a game of cards. Pretty sure he threw that hand. You won a bar in a card game? You must have phenomenal luck. I got contacts and a healthy survival instinct. In my business, that's better than luck. Usually. Every sucker who's owned this dump's been dead within a year. Most didn't make it a month. Oh, hold up a second. What happened to the last owner? He was on a strider to Antium with the governor and it went down. Some say accident, some say a hit. Nobody made it back and the black box went missing. You think Dusty was the target? Or the governor? Dusty owed a lot to the wrong people, but dead men don't pay their debts. The governor? Not really worth the trouble, you know what I mean? Dusty's not the only owner to die in glitch circumstances, just the latest. People think this place is cursed. 
So the bar is cursed. Great. Now I've got enough trouble as it is. You'll be fine. It only gets owners and dine and dashes. And I may be lying about the last one. You're doing good work around here, freelancer. I'll get you a tab. First one's on the house. And if there's something you need, maybe I know some people. We'll see. Okay? You must be right. Yaro said I'd find you here. Yeah. You're the one who flew in with a hail of bullets and flaming glory. Not sure that sounds right. Bet your ass it was. Stellar work, big star. You gotta live that crap out there. That was your moment. Me? I was looking forward to performing some community service with my sword Nelly. You named your sword. Well, why not? Besides you, she's the last thing standing between me and the cockroaches. So, I'm guessing you're here to stay. You've been keeping to yourself, but I've seen you around. If there's work, yeah. I get the impression business is picking up. Been tough for a while. A couple of weeks, I was barely scraping by. But man, there's nothing like being a freelancer, right? So hey, thanks for showing up when you did. I owe you one. Glad it worked out. Anyway, I'm probably still bleeding somewhere. Should get that fixed. I'll see you around, big star. Looks like this is your lucky day. Why's that? You just bumped into the oldest man in Fort Tarsis. Name's Jarek. Nice to meet you. You too. You know, you don't live as long as I have without seeing some things. Yeah? Like what? I was there when the Scars swarmed the Fort's terraces. It was a bloodbath. Happened over 50 years ago, and it feels like yesterday. I was also there when the scars came over the walls. What do you think about that? I think you've seen a lot. You bet I have. More than you ever will, that's for sure. You don't even know me. Why would you assume that? Because my life has been filled with nothing but bloodshed and disaster. I've survived strider ambushes, dominion attacks and outlaws. I've even run from wyverns. I've seen enough death the last 50 lifetimes. And yet, somehow, I'm still kicking. So what's your secret to survival? It ain't no secret. I'm a pragmatist. I always did what I had to in order to survive. I'm sorry. You must have lost many people along the way. You got that right. I've outlived every friend I ever had. Sometimes, I wonder if I made the right choices. I was in a mining crew digging for ore near Heliost when the main shaft collapsed. We were trapped behind a solid wall of rock. We had no idea of how long it would take for the rescue party to dig us out. I was lucky enough to find a bottle of water. But there were six of us. One bottle of water for six miners? How many of you made it out? I was the only survivor.
You're tough as nails. That's why you're still alive. I guess so. You guess? How else does one man live while five perish? I just did what I had to do. So what exactly did you have to do? If I'd have shared that water, nobody would have lived. So you chose to let five people die to save yourself? I told you, I'm a pragmatist. I guess that's why you're the oldest man in Fort Tarsus. Don't you judge me. You've seen death. You've done things. I can see it in your eyes. It's usually a glint of sadness or knowledge, but in some people, that glint turns into a gleam. And a gleam means they want to see more death. Be careful, freelancer. I still see a glint in your eyes. Some of the new Sentinel recruits are eager to face scars. Foolish. People don't realize the danger of standing water. Thank you. For what? For stepping close so you don't impede foot traffic. You were off to the side, so it seemed to make sense. My apologies. I assumed you would recognize me from one of my public safety forums. Sorry, I was not aware those were happening. My name is Pernal Blatch, and I'm the Fort Custodian. I maintain and improve all public works and spaces. Sounds like a big job. It's enormous. I'm seeking public input on an initiative to improve life in Fort Tarsus. Would you care to take part? No thanks, I'm kind of busy. If I told you we could tangibly improve Fort's safety, would you reconsider? I doubt it. Forget about safety then. How about quality of living? How do you feel about Fort Tarsus having a beautiful fountain that's just sitting dry? Why is that important? A fort is more than just stone and wood. Civic projects like fountains help make it a home. Okay. And people also need rules. Our fort needs more guidelines in order to function safely and efficiently. Really? More rules? Absolutely. Guidelines and protocols are the bones of social order. I hope you have a more open mind the next time we meet. Sure. 
I mean it. You watch your back. You think I haven't heard that before? You're kind. Ah, freelancer. I'm finishing up a few stories for the wall. This is a bad time? No, no, good time. <laughs> the task is better with company. This is not the grand wall of Freemark, but it's a good start. Why do you do this? The wall, the stories, all of it? For the history books? <laughs> I'm not that vain. Well, not about these things. You never saw the grand wall, eh? Oh, people came from every corner of Bastion to see it. They read our stories. They believed in us. People haven't changed. They'll see the work being done and come around. Of course they will. <laughs> what is it? My friend, the one I lost, I can hear him doubting us both. He could be a stormy sky. Ah, but I could make him laugh, huh? You said he was a freelancer? Yes, Garnet. Freelancer Garnet. I helped him pick that call sign, you know. It fit. He had a bad start, but survived it all. Oh, tough, that one. But one rainy day, he didn't come home. What happened? I don't know. Not all of it. Not where he fell. You see, I have his name, but not his story. This pains me. He was beyond the wall making things better. The details don't matter. Of course, of course, I know this. Just... It pains me. Someone was counting on him to be there. And he was. That is why I send you out there to pay your respects. To gather stories for our wall. Maybe one day, you bring his story back. Lucky Jack. Keeping busy? You know it. Just had a contract dealing with Scars. I show up and they mess him with a relic. Good thing some buddies jump on the call. We've got elementals swarming, Scars everywhere, then a love-struck Korox shows up. What happened? Teamwork, fancy flying, and one heck of a lucky shot. Next thing I know, the relic's silent, the Korox has a new friend, and we come out all right. Starting to see where you got the nickname. It could have gone straight sideways, I'm telling you, but that's what family's for. Stronger together, right? Backup's handy, but it's nice to fly out solo, too. Time in your own, just you and a cipher against the wild. I hear you. Whatever's right for the moment. My next gig might be solo at this point. Is there a problem? My buddies and I thought we'd team up on another contract. Last one went well, so why not, right? Now they can't agree which job to take. I just want something logged in the pending contracts report. What are your options? An arcanist looking for a lost vault? Gotta love some mystery. Or the fort needs people to take on hostile wildlife. Guaranteed action there. Going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the creatures out there keeps you sharp. Makes the fort safer, too. That's what we're here for, isn't it? I'm all for that. All right, buddy. Using you as the tiebreaker. Wish me luck. I'm not sure you need it. Yeah, yeah. I'll see you around. today.
Looks been well. Emoji thumbs up. <laughs> 